Key West is only like four miles by two miles, so it's not very big. But I think it's really cool that they've set a lot of things away. You know, this piece of land would, would garner a lot of money, but I like that they try to set things aside for the things that belong here. Hi hey guys, I won't bug you. There's a bunch of you though. I'm sorry. Turtles. They give you uh, turtle food. People came before me, they got it. I didn't ask for any. So there it is. There's a little turtle right there. I can see him, but I doubt you can. I said, They know. <laughs> They're helping you guys get all better. Oh, you're missing a foot. You're missing a leg. Sorry. You ready for your close up? That's not a blue heron, that is an egret. See, it has to turn its head because its eye is all messed up. It'll get you better. Good looking bird. You can see a lot of the cormorants here. I think those are gray pelicans. Not as big as the other ones. Still a pretty big bird. You're a big bird. They have a broad winged hawk. Oh, I'm making it nervous. Sorry, buddy. I mean, scare you. That's a secret. What are you doing, buddy? Double crested. Put the screen up so that they can relax. Looks like a vulture. So here we have three of our permanent residents. This is a red-bellied woodpecker.
It's unbelievable. See, I, I don't think I've been close enough to see the hair like that, you know? Yeah, they're used in a mating dance. Look at the feet. Yeah, monster like, feet. Could do some damage. Yeah. <laughs> so you live here? You're no. Is he a patient? No. He's just hanging out. Yeah. Those feet. So they said this land was given to the city and then the city gave them to them. But I guess the old mayor had donated, and they told me a name, and I forgot the name already. I'm terrible. But uh, apparently he was quite a character. He uh, water skied from Cuba to here. I guess he's in the Guinness Book of Records or something. So there you go. Yeah, every now and then you need some gee whiz, don't you? Sonny McCoy. Here's the story about the Key West mayor who water skied to Cuba. Sonny McCoy. Pause if you want to read it. And if you come down here, it's located right by the White Street Pier. It's a, this is basically the end of White Street. If you get down here, check it out. I'm going to sit for a minute. Again, this is... The refuge, it's on uh, White Street, basically the end of White Street. You can't see through the trees, but there's the ocean over there. So White Street Pier is right there, right over there. And the crossroad is Atlantic. So White Street tees into Atlantic, and this is the very end. And for RVers, I've actually seen a lot of Class Bs parked in the parking lot during the day here. I think uh, I think people do that a lot, and then I don't know what most of them do at night. They scatter around, but again, I'm not suggesting it. Five minutes to just be. Hi guys, I'm coming back. You guys, there's nothing wrong with you guys. You just like the free food. I hate to do it to you, but I'm gonna make you fly. Almost touch these guys. Almost, huh? You're not as scared. right by the bocce ball court which now have a lot of water in most of them I think there's one that's dry <laughs> but that's the White Street Pier right out over there and like I said there's some RVs that seem class B's that seem to hang out in this parking lot during the day again I'm not giving anybody any advice on what to do here more hawks in here you probably can't see it definitely hawks not 100% sure what kind. You're like the local dude, aren't you? But your beak is messed up. Hi. Hi. Hmm?
Yeah, he's got a lot of words. He likes to say cute. <laughs> I guess those two are broad-winged hawks. One is a turkey vulture. a few minutes ago somebody brought more chickens. Where they are used for pest control. So that's the good thing about these chickens. Okay, she was saying that the chickens here, some people don't like them so they get rounded up. And when they get too many of them, they take them up north where they're used for pest controls. They don't get eaten. Back here, some of it is open, clear view. Um, and a lot of it is kind of covered there with curtains and that's where we have birds that are going to be released as soon as possible and we're trying to prevent any human interaction so we ask you to just keep your voice down around those cages no touching the cages we've got a booby back there uh, a couple of hawks i've went by here a lot this is a park i walk around see there's one, two, that's a van, he's stealthing. One, two, three, four, five RVs. It's just a little park area, dog park over there. Swings, wreck a ball or a paddle ball. Or back in the New York days, handball. Did I mention the price? Free! But, you know, be a good person if you come here and give them a donation. These are all volunteers trying to help the animals. And they have a lot of iguanas, but it's kind of cold today, so they're probably hiding. That's a blue heron up there. Who knows if I come back next year, I might volunteer some time down here. Dude. Hey. 